So in this video I'm going to show you how the page hierarchy works in WordPress. <coughs> so if we go over into the all pages section of the web uh, of the dashboard, you'll notice notice if I scroll down you've got these uh, little dashes under some of the posts under under the pages. So this is what's called hierarchy. So you've got your parent at the top, so like a level 1, and then you've got the child, which is level 2. And then you can keep on going uh, further down so you can have child of that as well so this does affect the uh, the link of the page so if I go to view this page I'll show you what I mean so you can see that this page picks up the, uh, the parent the first parent and then the one underneath that the parent of that and the parent of that so you so that you can see that there's three different levels um, but if I go to level one then that will just show me the level one page, which is at the top, and so it does affect depending on um, if your page is um, a child of another page, then it will it will inherit the uh, the top level link. If that makes sense. So if we go to like for example this one again. See so if I go to level two, which is a, um, a sub page of level one, you'll notice it picks up the level one um, URL structure. So it always will take that structure. Okay, so I hope that kind of explains it. Um, if you want to change the parent, if I just go back into this uh, page that we were editing, because it's about us page to change the parent you would do it from the parent menu so this is where you can change the parent so let's create a, parent, a, a, um, a child of the about page so I'm going to create a new page here and we'll call this um, maybe a company mission and then we can change this to uh, to be the child of the so we're going to select its parent we're going to change it to about us and then we can publish this so you can see the link takes on the uh, inherits the top level um, page and then underneath that you've got the uh, under that you've got the actual child <coughs> so that's really that's how um, the hierarchy can work if you want to structure the URLs like this then that can be quite useful if you don't want it to structure it like that you know you could just have company mission on its own and so then you just take it out as no parent and then it would just have its own um, link without being a, a parent uh, without being a child of any page so I hope that kind of explains it that's a uh, page hierarchy and in the next video we'll talk about using page templates